paper tiger I'm doing a video of VR for his contest he wanted to know one thing I thought in my pack that was important and one thing in my pack I thought was important that I needed to upgrade I wanted to upgrade the thing I think is, is important is my fire kit which I slightly went overboard on my fire kit He said slightly, folks. Yeah, slightly. I explained to him why I'm laying this one down so softly. Money, money, damn it, money! I see money. Okay, anyway, <laughs> but that, that is my fire kit. Big bag is just uh, lots of fat wood. That's all's in that bag is. As the British people say as I watch on YouTube, chocker block. Well, what the hell it means. <laughs> Quoting people you don't even understand, man. That's some shit right there. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. And this one. Oh, yeah. Flint and steel kit with some candle wick. And I'm still practicing with this thing. It's hot. Did you just literally say it's hard? Yeah, it's hard. Did you go all boston -y on me? Whatever. Yeah, I went Yankee. <laughs> another striker. Candle wick. Another flint and steel kit. And under the bottom... He has some char cloth under there. Hey. <clears throat> Fix that in a minute. Fire piston. Like I said, I go a little overboard. You just want to stay warm when it's cold. That's the way I look at it. Is uh, that David Canterbury? Yeah, that's Mini Inferno. Damn, oh my. Strike Force. And it does have the Micro Infernos in it. What the hell for? And I don't count. It, this ain't counting all the friggin' cotton balls with Vaseline and... Tubes of miscellaneous gunpowder I've got in my pack. Yes, I carry gunpowder in my packs. I done went over all that in. No, you didn't say what was that little keychain thingy. Another ferro rod. Okay. That's part of my everyday carry. And a peanut lighter. Dude, you got all kinds of shit. I didn't even know you had that. I think I'm going to have to steal it. That comes up messing off that keychain. <laughs> I'm going to go to somebody's ass. Hey, I got a little canister that almost looks like that. Yeah, I you do never too. notice it. Yeah, I do too. I got several of them little canisters. You never, you would never notice it was missing until you needed it, and then it'd be too late. Your ass would be froze. Okay, I will. The last one. The most fragilest one. Okay, keep your hands right there. Don't move your hands. I zoomed in on it. Six power magnifying glass. Ooh. 
when all else fails, where I don't want to waste my other stuff. And have you used it? Yes, I have used it. Don't you also got one of them Ferrisium lenses? Fresno lens? Yeah, that thing. Yeah, okay, it's scratched all the crap. It ain't worth a hill of beans. Right Which you've used it to light your cigarettes with, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah, I run out of a. Uh, I left home one day without my cigarette lighter and I used my ferner. 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 Fer fer yeah, fer that thing. Lens. <laughs> I used my Fresnel lens to light my cigarette. <laughs> well, that's a. I got some really strange looks that day at work. That's a really. Uh, as he said, the things. Well, I not only got one thing I wish that I have upgraded, I actually got two. What? The things you just want to update in your pack. First one of mine was a old Schrade gut hook skinner. It looks uh, like a nice knife. It has. It's good in many a deer too. And you know I've never used a gut hook. That's hard to believe since you've never shot a deer. Oh, you kiss my ass too, boy. <laughs> that was one of my two that I wanted to upgrade. I upgraded it with a Pathfinder PLSK1. Ooh, pretty nice. That's a good heavy knife. Don't let Michelle see that thing. And yes, I'm mean on my knives. Don't let Michelle see that. She'll steal it from you. <laughs> Second one. Old, cheap, Walmart machete. It's good when you ain't got nothing else. But I upgraded. What? Ontario SP8. Wait a minute, you can't hardly see it. We need some light, damn it. Yeah, Put it over here on the light a little more. There you go. Yeah. It's the Ontario SP8. That's a nice little damn didger, my dadger. It's uh, over a quarter inch thick. About three and a half, maybe four pounds. <laughs> Swing this thing all day. I don't think you can stick somebody with it, but you can damn sure cleave off their head. Yeah, it, it works for that, and it also works for a good digging tool. Dug out a couple of fire pits with it. You rough on your shit. Yes, well, this one I know that I was going to be rough on it when I bought it. Is it full tang? No, it's like a, a rat tail. Oh, well. But, but then again, you pay. I don't think it's full tank. I ain't never read that. It was uh, when I bought it. It was they've come down a little bit in the past couple of years. But when I bought this, and there's uh, seventy five dollars. Wow. And it's only about nine inches. Nice. Now, we're going to interview you. Oh, crap. <laughs> Are you going to start making more videos? I'm going to try to. In case you didn't realize it, that's Uncle Redneck. Oh, one thing. For y'all people that like a good heavy knife and decide y'all might want to get this one, make sure you clip button all four. This is my second one. I only buttoned this one at work one day. Yeah, I lost a seventy-five dollar knife in the woods. And I still haven't found it. Well, I go back to the woods and find it. I did for four days. Well, I'd make it eight. <laughs> I figure some young and found it and said, "Hey, I found me a machete." You know that's going on YouTube, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Do you enjoy watching Jamie Town? Yes. Why don't you talk more? 
Dude, do you know how hard it is for me to sit here and talk to you with that thing in my face? Well, that's not the point. There ain't uh, nothing yeah. in your face when you're watching on Jamie time, unless you got a camera. Have you got a camera? No, I ain't well, got Well, do you? Camera. No, you I ain't got a camera. <laughs> do you want me to get you one? No. <laughs> then we can then we can really run the redneck zone. Uh, yeah. No. Because Doodle's wanting to get his laptop up and run so he can re- help me run it. And besides, I'm a sh- very quiet person. You don't believe that, do you? You shouldn't. <laughs> and I ain't like you. <laughs> I keep my rants to myself. What? Oh yeah, I gotta do some more rants. I did. Well, I did a couple, but either my camera or my computer ate them. Hey, y'all think he rants on there? Y'all should live with a mother hunter. <laughs> Every day. <laughs> I go off on some weird tangents, don't I? Weird hell. Them things is beyond weird. Look, he's putting his bag back together. Anyway. Too much stuff in a little bag. How do you like being part of the I'm a Redneck Cockerham channel? Ain't nothing wrong with being a Redneck Cockerham. Oh, people want to know. Why, how did we get the name? Now explain to them why we got the name I'm a Redneck. Because we is Rednecks. Every one of us that's on the channel is a Redneck, ain't we? Damn right. Now explain to him how we got the name Cockerham. That's our name. It's actually not Cockerham, it's Cockrum. <laughs> yeah, ain't it? Yeah, it's Cockrum, but if you read it the way it's wrote, it's spelled Cockerham. <laughs> cock or ham. Do you want cock or do you want ham? Uh, oh, no, no, I had no. to cut that part out. <laughs> yeah, you that. <laughs> unless she's a good, Unless, of course, she's a good-looking girl, then, you know... Then you still need to edit that out. <laughs> Anywho. Too much stuff in a little bitty bag. Fat man in a little coat. <laughs> Tommy boy. I, I would make, yeah, that's what I started with. Oh, no, 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 that's from somewhere. Fat man in a little coat. <laughs> okay, we're out of here, people. Raleigh, say goodbye to the camera. Peace and a half. Oh, God damn, you took my sand. <laughs> it was mine before it was yours, bitch. No, it wasn't. Okay, anyway.